Hello everyone, today I would like to show you how to decorate glass candle holder with rice paper. Perhaps you could use it in the garden and enjoy candlelight while drinking glass of wine on summer evenings. I have these two gorgeous holders which I got from Carboot Sale for a couple of pounds about a year ago. My plan is to cover top of the dish with rice paper and create brass effect on base. First, we need to draw leaves around base with pen and then cover them with relief paste. I will be using white relief paste. When everything is dry, we can start gluing rice paper. Remember that you need to tear paper with fingers for better blending. As you can see, my roses are quite large and the glass is round, so I need to tear images towards the center to avoid wrinkles. Now we can start gluing. Apply glue under the pictures as well as on top. Start from the middle and work your way around by pressing brush really hard to smooth any imperfections. It doesn't matter that edges cover each other, this won't be visible when we finish our project. If you don't tear large images towards the center and start gluing on round surfaces, you will end up with horrible wrinkles. At this point, we need to cover the rest of our dish with white plain rice paper. Prepare it by tearing it for smaller and larger, piece, larger pieces. For gluing, I strongly recommend small flat brush. Make sure to apply glue under the paper as well as on top, pressing your brush hard to avoid air bubbles. Rice paper is perfect for beginners as it's very thin and strong at the same time. Even if something goes wrong, you can lift it up and start from the scratch. As usual, links to all the supplies I used and much more can be found in the description under this video. For international posting, you will need to read our terms and conditions.
Now we can remove excess paper around the edges. This time I will be using sharp knife, but sandpaper would work as well. Please check that edges are glued properly. If not, this is the time to fix this. I've also decided to add more details around the base by applying more relief paste. When everything was properly dry, I painted my candle holder with white primer twice using brush and sponges. If you like it like that, you could finish at this point. Next step is varnishing. Because I plan to add wax paste on my base, I apply only two or three coats of varnish there and no sanding, as this will damage my relief. Top part will need more coats with sanding between three layers and we repeat these steps until we are happy with the finish. I hope this makes sense to you. Now we need to cover top part with masking tape. It is important to apply wax paste on top of varnish, not the other way around. Use your universal tool, which are your fingers, to do so.
I've decided to use this grey wax paste, but this didn't look good with my roses, so I covered it with brass wax paste. Don't forget about top edge At the very end, add liquid pearls around the edge and flowers and your candle holder is ready. Now you can pour yourself a glass of wine, light the candle and relax. Thank you for watching and don't forget, don't forget to subscribe to my channel or follow me on Facebook. Thanks, bye!